Gary, thanks. Our team coverage continues as an answer arrives to deal with potentially deadly situations brought on by winter storm. It's called the Blizzard Buster, and Dane County officials will be watching to see if it lives up to its name. News 3 reporter Dave Delosier joins us. He's on the backyard patio. Dave, this thing... It'll definitely get your attention, right? Yeah, I got to tell you, you, you got to see this thing to believe it. So hang with us for a little bit here, because I can tell you the first time I saw it, it was like, what the heck is that? It's a little bit pickup truck. It's a little bit snowmobile. And hopefully it's going to be a whole lot of help in saving lives. Last year, we had one heck of a winter. At first glance, it looks like just another pickup truck. But look again. This is definitely not your father's pickup truck, and to a guy, it looks like the gotta have toy of the year. It's pretty fun. It brings out the boy in you, I have to say, when you first see these tracks. But this is definitely not a toy. It is hopefully the answer to this. February 6, 2008, a blizzard shut down the interstate in Wisconsin and stranded motors for days because there was no way to reach them. A frustration law enforcement has not forgotten about. And our inability at that time to get to, get to people in need, to today, we are prepared for those exact type of situations. With this blizzard buster, getting to stranded motorists or homes will be possible. Dane County is one of the first agencies in this country to test the blizzard buster. If this pilot goes well, the county has plans to purchase three more next year. While the blizzard buster costs $25,000, the county sees this from the perspective of the lives it could save. We have a very you know, diverse county um, geographically, You know, not only urban, but we have some very rural areas. We have some areas that are tough to get to. Um, someone can slide off a road and you need to get down there. And so really, you know, saving lives and protecting our public has to be number one. While it may look a little strange, get used to it. This is Wisconsin and this is winter. And you may be seeing a whole lot more of it with the next storm. We know it's going to happen, so we need to be prepared. Now, the blizzard buster, blizzard buster was actually developed in Canada. And in addition to the Blizzard Buster, the Dane County has also purchased 16 four-wheel drive SUVs for Dane County Sheriff's officers. So, Eric and Michelle, if that storm materializes this weekend and causes the problems that it could potentially do, all this equipment's going to come in very handy. Oh, yeah. And, you know, it does make you giggle a little bit because you see this big toy. It looks but... like fun to drive, doesn't <laughs> yeah. it? But still, yeah. very important. Absolutely. Yeah, a lifesaver, you bet. Thanks, Dave, Dave, thanks.